A flood warning in effect tonight along the St. Clair River. Ice jams have flooded main roads and homes uh, from Algonac all the way to Port Huron. Tim Pamplin is in St. Clair County with a night cam. This is a dangerous situation in Algonac tonight. The St. Clair River now flowing over the seawalls, dumping frozen water into Algonac. This water now making its way into homes and stranding residents in their riverfront neighborhoods. I've lived here for about uh, 45 years now, and the water is as high as I've ever seen it. An ice jam near Harsons Island is creating a dam effect, sending the water into Algonac and stranding neighbors in their homes. And this is the worst I've ever seen it. That's Algonac Councilman Rocky Gillis says he was on a Zoom meeting. When he stepped out his home, he saw icy water up around his and his neighbors' homes. I spoke to the fire chief earlier. He says they're standing by their staff. They're ready to help once the 911 calls start coming in. Luckily, we've got the Griffin on its way. The Griffin is a Canadian Coast Guard cutter, usually seen up in the St. Lawrence Seaway. It's heading this way, and already on the scene is a U.S. Coast Guard Bristol Bay. Residents hoping they can soon cut a pass through the ice jam and let some of this water recede. Here's Councilman Gillis again. Uh, help your neighbor. Take, you know, take care of each other. Call the emergency services if you need it. So back out here as the icy water continues to inundate Algonac as I zoom in down there, that driver's going to have to turn around. They're on a peninsula, a bit of land that juts out into the river. They simply can't get through to get onto the mainland. A perilous situation in Algonac tonight with the night cam, Tim Pamplin, Local 4.